Hi there, this is Paul Pona and I'm super excited to introduce you to Doodle Maker. Now, Doodle Maker has been over two years in the making and it has been a lot of hard work to bring it to this level. Now, what is so exciting about Doodle Maker? Well, there are three components for it. Now, there is for example, ready-made templates. We have over 300 of them with male and female voiceovers and all that good stuff already done. Can create beautiful color doodle videos, black and white, glass board, white board, and even your own backgrounds. And so I'll show you that in just a second. And more importantly, for the first time ever, you can create doodle videos completely with artificial intelligence using this option right here called start from scratch meaning you paste a script and automatically it's going to create the doodle videos for you and then on top of that not only is that powerful we could have stopped there we went a step further you also have the ai video translation engine which is you bring in any video that you already have and it's going to not only convert them into doodle videos and any youtube video that you want to bring in but more importantly, can automatically transcribe it and convert it into another language using our text-to-speech and artificial intelligence engine. So that means you can literally convert any video, including videos that we've you created with our other apps into a doodle video. Powerful, right? All right, let's have some fun now. So instead of going through the actual ready-made templates which you've probably seen before which are all these templates of course they're all editable we've done that quite a few other people have done that too i wanted to actually go through the other part of the ai engine right now because it all culminates together you can use that ai engine also for templates as well that you're working on to add extra oomph to your videos or add extra length to your videos and make them more exciting and so on if you want to increase the length of these templates and make them more flexible but anyway let's go back to create project click on from scratch new project i'm going to put this project name as eight tips to lose weight something which is a very common if you will video that is educational in nature and so on and so here there's two options obviously if you have a voiceover already then pretty much you can import that in but if you don't have one you can also use our world-class text-to-speech engine anyways so here i'm just gonna do simple stuff okay i'm gonna just type in or you can copy paste the script as well slide one slide two slide three and so on and so forth so here it's gonna separate each of these based upon a slide right and then click on next slide. And these are the eight tips that I wanted to put in here. I'm gonna eat, eat a high protein diet. Next thing is avoid sugary drinks. Uh, and then we have drink water before meals. And then we have the next uh, tip, which is right here, choose fresh organic food. And then we go next, we're gonna put in eat soluble fiber, which is good for your diet. And then we're gonna go drink tea. That was another choice. We'll go uh, add slide and then base your diet on whole foods. Basically, as you know, whole foods are really good for you. And then eat slowly, okay? So now, pretty straightforward. Here to your right, you have some options here. Scene background, white, blackboard, glassboard, custom color, meaning you can put blueprint color, green, and whatever you want. You can even put an image as a background, which is really cool. You can also put hand styles, right? All these hand styles. Uh, what you want to put in there up to you. I'm going to keep it generic for now. You can even choose a background audio file, right? Which is really, really powerful. And this is a speech language. So you can even change the language of it uh, to whatever you want. So for example, if I'm creating a video in Spanish, I would put this right here, these slides in that language so that it'll look perfect and it would match, right? And of course, you can also, for that matter, uh, translated later on anyways so you don't have to worry about it what I would personally do it is do it in English and then translate it later it's more easier and makes that AI engine much more perfect for you to work with so now let's go next and then I'm gonna click save and then there you go in just a few seconds automatically it's gonna pick me all the doodle assets that will be relevant to this so for example eat a high protein breakfast it's going to have this breakfast uh you know icon right here as well as the doodle uh, assets here so i can change the color of it by the way red color like so i can change this one you see that there's this avoid foods right i can change this into green i can change this one into red i can change this one into blue you get the idea i can change the color i can resize it everything is editable i can even change what the transition will be i want this one to fade in i want this one to be drawn 
Uh, I want this one to slide in from the top to bottom, uh, you know, for example, bottom to top, that kind of thing. I can do all kinds of good stuff, right? And then I can even change them into layers, like you send backwards, send forward, and so on and so forth. I can even put the uh, timers here. I can even make sure that they hide after they show once and so on, as you can see here in the timeline settings to my right. All right, so all we have to do now, it's very easy, is if you see the preview of this element right here, for example, and I'll show you that right now, it created that without me having to do any of the extra work, right? So if I click preview, there you Eat go. A high protein it's actually breakfast. sketching that, right? And then if I go into the next slide, again, they're all gonna get merged together and they're gonna render perfectly. So click that preview. Avoid sugary that. drinks and fruit juice. Awesome. And then I can even change the text to speech voice. So I can put a male voice here, right? And then I can go ahead and I can do all kinds of customizations here and so on. Now, this is already done. The whole video is done. It took me two seconds, you see? We are even having some of these color doodle videos and so on and so forth, right? You see that we have this color doodle and so on and so forth. Now, if you don't like anything, you wanna change anything, right? This is where it becomes really, really powerful because artificial intelligence is great. It's only gonna get better and better and better with time as it gets more data from users and we get more uh, integrations done and so on which is awesome, but you wanna add more flexibility. We have the world's biggest vectors, icons, and doodle assets not available anywhere else. Why is it available in our application? Well, I specifically went in and I paid thousands of dollars every single month to ensure I get the library access to some of the biggest ones out there. So for example, here, if I wanted to put in and I want to change any element, let's go back to one of the slides here, right? This one right here, right? What was it? Avoid sugary drinks, right? And fruit juice, okay? So if I wanted to go back let's uh, and find in, I just have to click on the slide like so. I clicked on it and this opened up all these options here, right? I go to library and I go into this jump story, for example, and I just put fruit juice as an example and boom, I'm gonna get a whole bunch of color doodle assets that you see right here. See that, how powerful it is? So for example, this is fruit juice, I love it. I just click on it, boom, it gets inserted right here. So now, instead of this old school stuff, let's say, and which is really perfect as well, if you wanna use it, for you can just delete that element and put this one here, and I can get that hand drawn, fade in, slide in, and so on and so forth. I can resize it, I can make it uh, hide after it shows up. I can do all kinds of good stuff. So let me preview this slide so you can see it. Avoid sugary drinks and fruit juice. Did you see that, how cool that is? So that means you can literally do color doodle videos either through artificial intelligence, but also through customization. And here's the thing, you know, these slides are fully customizable, so you can move things around, you can make things really, really relevant to what you're trying to do. So for example, if I wanted to, you know, go back to this uh, final slide, right? And I wanted to basically remove this and I wanna make it, for example, eat slowly. If I wanna edit that text, I can edit it right here, okay? I can say, uh, call us now for more details or something like that or even let's just say visit our website today and then dot 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 and you can put a website url here and so on but i'm just going to rebuild the scene i'm going to show you what happens okay so here as you can see here we got the website doodles right automatically found by us and then i can change the color of it again you see that our blue color and so on but if you wanna go a step further, there's always the library, which is constantly getting added. We're adding thousands of these assets to the library. We have icons, icon finder, we have even images and so on. I'll talk about that in just a second. But if you wanted to go, let's just go put website here, right? And then we're gonna get a whole bunch of stuff related to websites that you can pick right away and you don't have to do anything else on your part. All of this stuff, you see this? Beautiful looking stuff, right? You don't have to, like, look at this one, this one, beautiful. I love this one. So I'm just gonna select that one. I'm gonna replace this with that. And see, the app is doing all the thinking, right? So I just have to come in and I just have to come up and uh, do the stuff and it's ready to go. And again, if I want it to be sketched, I want it to be faded in and so on and so forth. Let's say I wanted it to be hand-drawn, for example. So uh, I'll show you how that looks like just right now, okay? So preview that. Visit our website today. See that? beautiful looking color doodle videos in just a few clicks. Nothing has ever been done 
anywhere close to this. And here's the best part. As we're making our artificial intelligence better and better, we want to incorporate these colors into the actual uh, videos as well to make them standard. And so what we're going to be doing is we're going to getting be getting the user data that we get from other users and make that possible. And here's the better part. Okay, so let me show you something really cool. So let's delete this element. And let's delete this element as well. What I wanted to show you is, let's say you wanted to put a uh, image, right? And you wanted to talk about call us today or visit our website today. So let's say we, the call to action was call us today, right? So what we can do, let's click the save text. I don't want to use it. Let me use another image using our background removal feature. Super, super powerful. So let's say I uh, got an image, which was, for example, let's say everybody knows Pixabay, right? So let's just get an image from phone call or something like that, right? Like a phone uh, message, right? So let's see here, pretty powerful stuff. Let's see one of these images related to phones, okay? And we have quite a bit of them actually here, right? Pretty good stuff. So let's, this one, this one looks nice, right? So let's add this one in. But before I add that though, let me uh, show you what we have capable here, right? We can even change the gradients of it to make it like a drawing color, uh, type of gradient and so on. That's pretty powerful. But here is even cooler, okay? I can go in and I can add this in, right? And here, check this out. I have a remove background option right here. So check this out. Click on it, remove background, boom, yes. Check this out, you're gonna be blown away. Boom, done. In a few seconds, we have the background removed here and I can stretch it and so on and so forth. I can add text here and so on, that's all good stuff, but check this out, okay? Now, what I can do is I can change the transparency of it slightly and I can make that into like, for example, a uh, hand painting, right? Or a reveal, right? Hand painting, reveals, whatever you wanna do, you can do that. So for example, if I wanna do a reveal section, like preview. Call us today. Check that. You can do that. Uh, you can even do, for example, a, a hand painting uh, thing that I was telling you about and change the speed of it, how quickly you want it, how slow you want it, and so on. You have the full flexibility here. So, for example, you want to do that. Let's click preview. Call us today. There you go. So you can even do that as well if you wanted to really, uh, you know, ramp up your video creation. And another cool thing is because you can convert it into a black and white doodle style as well, it gives you even more capabilities where you can convert any image into a doodle style painting as well. So let me show you that example as well because I wanted to cover that uh, prior. So let's click on that. Let's go back into, for example, uh, the library all over again. Let's just go to this and choose which one we want to do here. Boom, let's say it's this one, we wanna use this, okay? We wanna delete this, right? And then let's delete this element, put that here. We wanna change the background, let's do that right now. Click on that button, then it's gonna go do its thing, removing that background over to give that pixel perfect drawing or that reveal, right? And again, you can do that hand painting effect, fade in, reveal, whatever you want, and it looks perfect. Call us today. Like, look at that. So you're basically making any kind of art, if you will, or a creative process using this exact customizations that you have available. And here's the thing, because of the fact that we have these backgrounds, we can put a custom color background and do it. One of the big ones a lot of people like to do is maybe a blueprint style background like so, right? And with a blueprint, maybe you wanted to add some other elements here. For example, go back to the library. Uh, we wanna put, say, uh, call us, right? Let's put a phone here. Uh, and, and you wanna put a phone-based uh, system, right? That will be related to a phone. So let's find one, uh, like this one. This one's nice. So let's click on that, and boom. Now we're asking them to call us, and then we can have a call to action. We can do whatever we want to do here. We can even have an image that says call us and the URL of it or whatever. Now here, again, I can do the reveal. I can do a fade in effect. I can do all that. So let me actually show you a slide from the left option here, okay? So check, check that out, preview. Call us today. There you go. You see that? So the transitions are fully flexible. You can do hand transitions, painting style. You can do sketching style. You can do it, for example, even as a drawing as well. And here's the thing, because of the fact that you can do color doodles, it gives you more flexibility. So you would you know, not only do like a blueprint style video like this, so meaning for blueprint, I would have to make it white, correct? 
because blueprint would be more architecture related. I can do that. I can do green board, glass board, glass board, which is the opposite direction and so on. I can do all kinds of good stuff. And this makes it extremely powerful. And you can even watermark things. You can add soundtracks. You can change the language over and it'll automatically change the language of the text to speech into any language that you wish. And you can even, for example, as you can see here, change all these English voices. If I change the language over to another language, for example, so let's say because of the auto translate. So let's say I make that into Spanish as an example, right? Use the auto translation, update it, right? Like I this, it automatically translated this. And here's the thing, automatically all the images were found by AI anyways, right? So now what happens is even the text to speech, okay, here's the best part, got translated into that, okay? So check this out. We have uh, all these other ones, right? Spanish, let's say this. Let's awesome, right? And now you can create a video and now you got a Spanish video created in just a few minutes. It didn't take any long. Now, there's so many other features I wanna go through, but this is the beauty. One, you can create professional looking videos using our templates within a few clicks. You wanna go a step further, you can customize those templates. And then if you wanna do the artificial intelligence style, you can do that too. And the final part, which I didn't get to, is the AI translation engine, which is you click on it right here, and you can literally put any YouTube video, and then it's gonna convert that video into a multilingual video, first of all, and also a doodle video in that language as well. So easy to use. I'll show you that in just a second. So, all right, so I'm gonna make a title here, let's say, right? So for example, in this case, it's another weight loss video as an example, and it's a big uh, industry, so I thought it would be a good example, but it can be any video for that matter. Uh, and then click on the get YouTube video, and as long as that video has voice in it, it's gonna automatically transcribe it, which costs quite a bit of money on our end, and then it will automatically put them into different slides, which is really powerful, because then you don't have to do a lot of the thinking. And you can edit every element, obviously, and I recommend you to edit it, obviously, to make it unique to your own way of thinking and, and so on. And then the cool thing is, right, you can actually go into the next step. Let's click Save, and then boom, it's gonna do our Doodle video creation all over again, right? Create the slides for us, as you can see, and all that. And here's the best part. You can convert that language at this point as well. So now you go in there and I want to change it over into, for example, uh, let's see here. Uh, all right. Let's see Italian. Let's click update. And then it's going to convert this into Italian, all this text and keep those active. So it's relevant to what you're trying to show. And the voiceover as well, you can choose all these as you can see here, right? And it's very, very powerful because of this reason. And automatically, I press one button, and automatically convert that into text to speech. Now I can preview it, I can change elements here, as you can see, every element, I can change the color of each of them, I can make sure that they disappear after showing, I can do all kinds of good stuff. And then all these slides got created automatically, as you can see here, right? And this is right here, extremely, extremely powerful, because all that work is already done for us. Now, you wanna change any elements. Like for example, if I wanted to do, it's important to enjoy the food, right? Enjoy that word, joy, right? Happy. So let's go pick uh, you know, some related stuff based on that happy thing. So let me do that real quickly. So I go back into the library. Let's go find something that is related to happy. Let's see, hopefully we'll find something really cool. All right, so now we wanna put this, we can do all these as well, right? Check this out. All these are available that is related to being happy, right? And this is the great part. And that means, so let's say for example, I like one of these, okay? I like this one. I put that over and I'm super happy. So I remove this right here and I'm happy here. I do that and then it's gonna create this beautiful looking sketch of this as well which is extremely powerful. Nobody has, has ever done something like this. So hope you enjoyed watching this video. There's so much more. I'm gonna be coming up with a lot of other similar videos like this one to showcase the true power of it. What you're seeing right now is just the tip of the iceberg. I can go into a lot more detail of some of the other elements behind the scenes that makes it even more powerful, which I will do coming up soon. So thanks for watching.